I went to Arcalis yesterday. What I did was I skied down all the runs on the sunny side. And the reason why I didn't ski on the dark side was because there were too many skiers over there, especially beginners. My theory is that they came to Andorra to ski because there is no snow at anywhere they were supposed to go, so they devoted to Andorra where there is snow. It was packed with beginners. Later on in this video, I will explain the numbers on the circle signs along the slope in the video clip skiing down the Meca Verda. As one of my viewers who will arrive in Andorra soon was asking me about the name of the run along with the number. Now back to the snow conditions business on the sunny side. They were perfect, even down at the bottom. It was nice and enjoyable all the way through. But y'all remember one thing. The conditions can change without hours notice. It can be good to ski on in the morning, but icy or slushy later on into the day. But I doubt it as it's snowing as I'm speaking up at Arcalis, Gran Valera, lightly at Arancel, and about to at Pau. Awesome news for some of my viewers who are arriving this weekend.
remember this bit from my video of Artalis last week? A total sheet of ice, remember? Not today, y'all. Good skiable snow all the way down to the lift. Yay! As mentioned at the beginning of this video, this is El Tunel on Mega Verda. The number starts at 26 where the video clip started. Then it gradually went down to number 1 where El Tunel on Mega Verda stops and another run picks up on the same Mega Verda. Mega Verda is a long, easy run from the top to the bottom of Arcalis, 8 kilometers total, as I mentioned in my last Arcalis No Report video. Good long run with gentle slopes and turns for beginners to practice. That's how I interpret the number logically and that's how they work in most or all of the European ski resorts. Feel free to correct me if I'm wrong on this or if anyone has a better explanation pertaining to this subject matter, don't hesitate to let me know by dropping me a comment and uh, I will post it on my video. Thanks a million. As requested from some of my viewers, I will definitely video more details as far as names of the runs, names of the slopes, names of the areas I'm skiing in, etc. Please drop me a comment uh, if y'all have anything else to add to the list. Alrighty then, that's all for me. Y'all enjoy the rest of the video to see the snow condition on uh, different runs plus the name of each run I was skiing at. Don't forget to give it a like, subscribe if y'all haven't done so already, and share the video with your fellow skiers. I thank you for watching and let it snow, let it snow, and let it snow. Happy skiing!